A breaking news update tonight on a story we first brought to you Friday. We are hearing reaction now to the safe return of a Davidson County girl. 14 year old Savannah Childress was reported missing 10 days ago. It was discovered she had been communicating with a man online prior to being taken. This is cell phone video showing the aftermath of a confrontation that Arkansas authorities had with the suspect. Police spotted the truck in a parking lot and ordered him to get out of the vehicle. That's when he opened fire, nearly killing one of the officers. He drove away with the 14 year old still in the car, but lost control in a snowbank. Police believe he then shot himself and died later at a hospital. The teen was recovered unharmed. I'm just glad she's found. Uh, I mean, you know, the entire community all came together looking for her and it's just such a widespread thing. And then to come to find out she was that far away, it's just, no matter how far away, just the fact that she was found, especially that far away, because once they get that far, usually they're never found. So just the fact that she was found is just a sigh of relief. Childress is back home safe and reunited with her family. He was a fiery voice of the civil rights movement, Malcolm X. 56 years ago today, he was gunned down during an appearance in a New York City ballroom. The anniversary comes as the contents in a letter written by a deceased NYPD officer was just released. It offers a side of the story that could get the case reopened. ABC's Zachary Keish explains.